too. For here, under the sea, we were to find the second clue to life on Venus. Hey Alex, aren't you supposed to be at work in like 30 minutes? No, I'm not. I actually have a snow day today. I got called off. Snow day? What? Me too, girl. I'm definitely not going to work. It's too cold outside. Nick, your work is like five minutes away. I don't care. It's so cold outside. Dude, that is a damn cold walk. Oh, you're right. Dead, deadly walk. Anyway, since we both have a snow day, what did you want to do today? I actually called up an old friend of mine from college, and he should be on the way here now. Wait, is it Darius? Hell no. No. Oh, okay. But so. no, we're probably just going to kick back and have a couple beers, watch a few movies and catch up. Free beers? I suppose you entitled ass. Well, I mean, I'm sure he'll give you one if you'd like. Okay. Yes. I'm yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Snow day, beer. I'll order a pizza. I'll get us a pizza. You'll get us a pizza. Beer, movies, oh, best day yeah. of all. Sounds like every day for you, right? Yeah, who wants to change up? I like the norm. Oh. Speak the devil. Cool, cool. So who'd you invite over anyway? Hey, hey. What? What the f Alex is having a snow day. I'm having a snow day for fucking sure because who the hell wants to go walking outside in that cold ass weather? I don't. And then she mentions that she invited an old friend from college to bring some beer and watch some movies and I'm like, free beer, fuck yeah. Then we're bullshitting about it. Lo and behold, boom, destiny. Dude is ringing the doorbell. She gets up, goes to answer it and um, who the fuck is it? Fucking Chris. I saw Professor Hazlitt the really? other day. Really? How is he doing? Uh, he's doing real well. Uh, just had his first kid. What? He's like the youngest guy that we had as a teacher, too. Yeah, uh, it was kind of weird. He was only a couple years older than we were. <laughs> uh, he was telling me all about her. She's running around the house. Uh, calls him by his first name, which is weird. They can be such uh, an irksome f sometimes, but honestly, I don't even know why I get mad anymore because he's been doing this for years. He acts like a child that I pay for. So that, that really turned me off from having kids. You know, I can't even imagine having anybody else to care for. And then, you know. Hey, Nick. What are you doing over there? Chilling. Show me. Uh-huh. Do you want to come hang out with us? You're looking a little rapey over there. Yeah, I'll come chill. Come chill with you guys. What's up, Chris? So I was sitting at home, uh, I got called off work, we had a real bad snowstorm last night, and uh, I was kind of bored until Alex called me up, old friend from college, she wanted to catch up. She said, why don't you come over, we'll have a few beers, we'll watch a movie or something, and we'll have a good time. I said, you know what, I love beers, I'm coming over. And uh, right when I got there, Nick uh, just was not happy at all. So uh, what have you been doing since graduation? Well, I uh, ended up gradu graduating with a bachelor's in fine arts, and I was considering going back to grad school, but at this point, i going for a curating position at some point. I can't just get that, but I have to work my way up somewhere. So. Well, you know, uh, funny, uh, I'm actually working at the uh, Galleria at... The Hunt uh, Gallery? Uh, th it'll be there. This, really? Uh, They're sitting there weekend, talking actually. about this stupid Hunt Gallery, like, I even have a clue what the f*** that's even about. What the f***? Talk about it. I feel stupid. So Alex and I are having this really intellectual conversation about the new Hunt Gallery, which if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's all over the internet right now. And I think I'm going to go uh, put her name in for a job at the gallery. I think if she really puts her mind to it, she can accomplish anything there. And this mother interrupted my television show. So I told him. So um, if you if you want to come on down, I'll, I'll teach you all the etiquette because some of these artists can be kind of temperamental. 
Uh, so I'll show you everything that you need to do to get along with them. <laughs> like sucking dick. To make me search for... I didn't know what. He hasn't seen Chris since college. And he tells him he needs to suck a dick. I don't even want to know what's going on in the kid's brain. <laughs> Classic Nick. <sighs> Damn it!